thing. Keep it going for him. Let's just keep this show going right now. Get your hands going right now for your next comedian. Keep it going for Cindy Foster. Hello, hello. Hello. Woo. So let's get this out of the way. Yes, if Scott Bayo was a lesbian, this is what he would look like. <laughs> For the older people, Chachi Arcola, for Charles in Charge, you know what I'm talking about, yeah. All right, so, uh, yeah, no, two years ago I woke up with this haircut, I had no intention of being a dyke, and I'm like, I'm just gonna go with this whole fucking thing. And so I got the starter kit, and you know, right, I got this, like, as a fucking, like, lesbian witch voodoo necklace in it, some Birkenstocks, and there's a uh, DVD on how to be angry, because, uh, true though, right? Les you can, don't be scared, because I'm not like a scary butch lens. I'm like a chapstick lesbian. <laughs> not really a lipstick, like a chapstick. And, uh, but lesbians were bullshit, and it's like, but I don't know why, because like, I'm getting more pussy than any of you guys in this whole room. <laughs> what the fuck do I have to be mad about? Absolutely nothing. Absolutely nothing. <sighs> I'm like a misfit lesbian, kind of. I, I can't play softball. And I thought of them. It's like these pre wet and I'm like, what the? You know, I look like you would want me on you. I look like you would You would be like, no, we want you on our team, right? I like, kind of look like I could play. Absolutely not. And I kind of thought about it, and I'm like, I thought it might be kind of like, uh, do you remember uh, on Rudolph, right? The Land of the Misfit Toys, remember that? Hey, we'll go back to that, that's really sweet. Now just picture this, right? And I don't know if it's like Ellen flying above with like her fucking Prius and a Shih Tzu, I don't know what's going on, but she drops my ass off on the island and I'm like, well, hi, I'm Cindy in a box and I'm a lesbian who can't play softball. It's the shit that I think of all the time. Now, you are real, I'm, you know, I'm jumping now because I'm like, I mean, if, obviously you know you're out of your league, right? Oh yeah, yeah, right? No, I'm, I've been in the same fucking situation, right? She's gorgeous, but you, this is the trick now. So do not keep telling her how beautiful she Don't, don't, right? Because the only thing, the only thing I can explain is like, it must be this, I, this like lack of self-esteem. Is that what we have going on with you? But if you build her up, it's sweet, because we want to be like, baby, I love you, so beautiful, it's beautiful, 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 right? He doesn't, I'm sure he does. You're a fucking loser, I'm telling you right now. <laughs> Do not let her realize how fucking hot she is. Don't do it. Absolutely, no. And you know, it's, this is adorable. I could fucking take her from you in like five minutes. I know, I really could. And there's a thing called, which you put, uh, there's many of you I can see, right? And, oh my God, let me see. There's a lot of you out there. Where are the straight ladies? Raise your hand. Go ahead. No, ma'am, you can put your hand down. I didn't say bisexual, I said straight. You put yours down there too. I'm getting the vibe from you. You're looking at it like, woo! No, 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 no. There's a bunch of you in here. Those are called alcohol induced lesbians. Those are AILs. Right here. Here she is. Could you mind just stand up, please? Just stand up. Stand up with your drink. An alcohol induced lesbian. That's when a straight lady has a fruity drink and she wants to sit on my lap and do kissy kissy. There we go. And I'm so good, I can actually get this man to buy the drink and I'll be doing kissy kissy with both of you ladies. <laughs> Fuck that. I'm sure he's, I'm sure he's okay. <laughs> I'm not gonna talk about dick. I mean, I left mine in my box underneath my bed. I'm not gonna go there with any of you. Christ's sakes. All the boys back there talking about Call of Duty and their dick. I'm like, Jesus. So, I'm just gonna say that my parents are in the audience and I'm gonna talk about vaginas and bush right now. My dad is here, and how fucked up is that? He's got plugs in, when he said bush, it's like, no, President Bush, that's what's going on here. President Bush. So I dated uh, this uh, much younger woman, 19 years younger. I'm 53, she was 34. Low self-esteem, she was fucking hot, I don't know what I'm talking about. And, uh, and she let me know that apparently there's this thing where there's no bush. I didn't know, I come from Western Mass, we grow up bush, we fucking braid it, we sit in women's circles. What the fuck is going on, no bush? I'm having sex, I'm having sex with this hot woman and I'm fucking like, do you remember the slip and slide as a kid? You know the fucking slip and slide? I'm fucking riding that child, woo, motherfucker! I'm going down and then like, there's no hay at the end to slow that shit down. 
break a fucking lesbian hip will be in the home by the end of the week, for Christ's sakes. Anyways, my time is up. Please check me out on Facebook, please. Cindy Foster, thank you, thank you, thank you. Keep it going for Cindy Foster. Let's just keep that energy going right now. Keep your hands going right now for Matt Alamin.